Hey, welcome to Passages in Applied Mechanics by Dr. Lorenz Garcia. Today, statics, reactions at beam supports. Beams are structural members designed to support loads applied at various points along their lengths. Beams are usually long, straight, solid bars with a uniform cross-sectional shape and a constant cross-sectional area. They are made from rolled structural steel, reinforced concrete, timber, or similar materials. Generally, beams are placed in horizontal position and carry vertical loads, meaning by it, they carry forces which are perpendicular to the axis of the beam. So, let us repeat it, a beam is a structural element that primarily resists loads applied laterally across the beam's axis. Its mode of deflection is primarily by bending, as loads produce reaction forces at the beam support. Beams are traditionally descriptions of building or civil engineering structural elements. However, any structure may contain beams, such as vehicle frames, aircraft components, machine frames, and other mechanical or structural systems. Any structural element, in any orientation, that primarily resists loads applied laterally across the element's axis is a beam. See around you, while you commute, are you able to identify beam in the structures that surround you? In the bus, in buildings, in machines or appliances. Beams are generally classified in accordance with the way in which they are supported and characterized by their manner of support, profile, equilibrium conditions, length, and material. Several types are, a simple supported beam, an overhanging beam or a cantilevered beam, etc. A simple supported beam is pinned at one end and roller supported at the other. Typical practical applications of simply supported beams with point loadings include bridges, beams in buildings, and beds of machine tools. An overhanging beam also rests on two similar supports, but extend beyond one or both of its supports. Overhanging beams are an important part of modern buildings, especially for structures that need extra support outside of the main building's perimeter. A cantilever beam is rigidly fixed at one end and free at the other. A good example of a cantilever beam is a balcony. A balcony is supported on one end only, the rest of the beam extends over open space, there is nothing supporting it on the other side. Other examples would be the end of a continuous beam of a high-rise building floor or the cantilevered girders of a bridge segment. Do you remember the three conditions of equilibrium are known as the three equations of statics? The procedure for calculating reactions at beam supports is one of the most practical applications of these three equilibrium equations. Let's apply these concepts to solve engineering problems. Dr. Lorenz Garcia here, thanks for watching. Ciao.